All right, so on this video, we are going to do the uh, first part of Better Together, which is the introduction part, which goes. So this song I did on YouTube um, 11 years ago, and I've had quite a few people request for a tutorial on it. Um, I actually did this song for my wife. It was her favorite song. Um, so it's actually one that I still play. And I have changed it just a little bit. Um, it may not be identical to the YouTube one that I have up, uh, but it is close enough. So we'll talk about the intro. Okay, so I'm playing in the right hand an F chord. F A C A C F C F A. We go from the F chord here to the C G C. So twice on the F chord C F A up to a B flat to C G C. Left hand is doing an F and a C. Oh, I'm sorry, it goes to an E. So the chords we use in the song are F. It's always good to know your chords and inversions. And we go to a C chord. Play the C chord and the F chord every way that you can. Um, D minor, D F A, F A D, A D F, back down, B flat chord, B flat and D F, D F B flat, F B flat D, and back down. So beginning part again. single G to a D minor chord, which is A, D, F. Left hand, F, E, D. After that, we go in the right hand, A, F, twice on the A, F, to a G and an E. Now bring the C down the left hand. And then I play that again single notes. Okay, then we go to a B flat chord, which I'm playing, just doing a bunch of octaves in the left hand, but I'm playing F, B flat, D, which again is a B flat chord, just played different order. So on our chords, we always have what we call root position. So in a B flat chord, the B flat is the root note. So it's the bottom note. Then we have our first inversion and second inversion. So it's really important to know your chords and the inversions with them. Um, okay, let's do that again. B flat octave of B flat left hand F B flat D in the right hand K 
Okay, then we go to an A in the left hand, so the left hand walks down. E, D, C, B flat, A. Right hand here, C, F, A, C. It's a F major chord. I have an octave of C there. Okay, if you can't hit the octave, it's fine. Just play F, A, C. did that after that B flat C B flat just a couple little passing tones Next up is our G minor chord. We're starting with a G in the left hand, D, F, C in the right hand. Now I can't remember what I'm playing there. Let's do that again. C to D, F, B flat. Okay, and then I'm hitting D and F by itself, and then up to an A. And the whole time, just keep that G held down. One more time. I'll do that first part again now from the beginning. Okay, next chord up is a C chord. C in the left hand, and we're doing Just single notes, E, C, E, F, C, F. Um. E, C, E, F, C, G, go right to a G. And just hold down that C in the left hand. So I'll take it back from here a little bit. And that is the first half of the intro. So we'll play that again all the way through. that same chord progression one more time which is just our F C chord over an E in the left hand D minor chord C chord um, so this time it's a little bit different we're gonna drop down an octave so we played it up here here's our middle C and we started one octave higher from our middle C now we're going to jump down. So after the uh, I'll play the next part here first. Okay, this one's a lot easier. So all we're doing here, left hand, octave of F. Right? 
So the right hand, F and A. We're playing an F chord the whole time. F and A, float that with the C, back and forth. Get to that C, F and A, to C, to the E and G. Okay, there's a couple ways I play this. So, um, Get there to that B flat. Let me do that again. Okay, so B flat. I'm playing a C and a D in the right hand, down to a B flat. Okay, C and D. Just the right hand, C and D, B flat, C, D. Then we go to our next F chord, A, C, F, with an A in the left hand. So B flat in the left. Okay, we'll do that part again. Last part. All right, now my left hand is doing a pretty big stretch here. We go from G to a D to a B flat. These are my pinky, second finger on the D, and my thumb on a D flat. If you can't reach that, do the octave G, D, and G. Left hand is going from the G, D, B flat down to the G, D, G. Okay, or you can just hold it there. Either way. Right hand. D, F, C. D, F, B flat. D, and then F and A. You can add it on, you can let go of the D either way is fine. Okay, I'm kind of rolling them out too when I first start. You can just hit it at once either way. Put those together. Okay, now the last part. E, C, E, F, C, F, G. And then we go into the song. Left hand just has a C and a G the whole time there. So let's try to put it all together. That'll be the next part. But there's your intro. Uh, let me know if you have any questions and I will get the next part up within the next couple of days or so.